expect it to be as competent as it was. Confident. It's not like it's not like an amazing film or anything, but like it's definitely not bad. Which is kind of strange. I thought it would be a dumpster fire. Maybe it was. I don't know. I I'm just sorry. like Sonic. I love Studio Opolis. I thought this song is such a pangu. It is so good. Sonic but, Mania has such good music. Oh, it's it's a chef kiss. It's it's nice and spicy. Yeah. Kind of a shame we only got Studio Opolis, but still though. Okay, but anyhow, yeah, it's sick. It's sick. It's so sick. It's so, and I, I know it's uh, uh, it's Dr. Gear's favorite. Mm -hmm. Um, but now on stream, we will be seeing Stock Teku 69 going with the Palutena, fighting Nolan Weezer Ryu. Nick, yeah, SSB. That, Nolan Weezer. I gotta say, big fan of unsponsored Weezer. Very big fan. Uh, got an autograph from him once. Great guy. Um, I, I love me Nolan Weezer Nichols. I'm a big fan. Big fan. Put me in the fan shoot. club. What is that shield crush shoot? He just down tilted like seven times in a row. I mean, obviously, it's going to be like, it's like the no mix up mix up. Like, he was just like waiting for Stock Teku to either drop it or for him to get the poke or something. Yeah, so Weezer, I think, you know, he was kind of playing a lot of D before. But now I think he's like playing a lot more Ryu. And you know what? I think it's the play. Ryu right now is really good. Yeah, no, for sure. That could do. That has definitely like no shortage of DPS, able to just rack on so much damage so quickly, and able to consistently clutch out stocks as well. Nice use of the um, the Hadouken there, actually just to maybe like stop Stock Taker's approach um, and force him off of the ledge a little bit. Yeah, and I will say this about Stock Taker, I feel like he's more known for his wall, but a lot of people don't know how amazing and, uh, you know, honestly really good his Palu is. I think at some uh, bigger tournaments, he's played like almost exclusively Palu. I think people kind of know him as the Wolf guy, though, so they don't know about it. But his Palu is honestly pretty much around the same caliber as his wolf. Yep. So you can't be sleeping on it. Trust me when I say it, it's a, it's a force. And something that you've noticed that he has to mix up in the matchup is he's not going for down tilt two frames. And that's because obviously Liu on the way up has a hitbox that is able to shark through the um, edge of the stage, and you want to actually be trying to go for drop-down backers um, against Ryu. You're able to get those quite consistently. What is, what is he doing? He was teabagging straight up. My man, you can only do that with a lead, just saying. He broke the rules. You know I could fairly off parents and dumb rules like the book? That's what he broke. You're not allowed to do that. And that is going to be the kill, but I don't not. think he intended for that. He wanted to get the true input up. He wanted to show you. Yeah. They're really unfortunate, but... They buffed that. It's okay. incredibly strong now. Um, it's crazy. It's kind of like a really solid burst option now. And it just kind of kills you at like 120-ish percent. Um, really a significant buff in my opinion. No, we're backing up a whole lot of percent right now. 31 percent just from a couple of uh, down tilts and two from the Tatsu. Also, just got a note. Shout out to M Blue for putting uh, custom music. So good. We get to listen to Rivers in the Desert on PS2. I mean, I'm down. I love me some Persona 5. Well, I'm going to have to ask him for a couple of special requests. Uh, Ooh, yeah, no, he's taking them. Oh, what? what the? That was, that was Yeah, that yeah. happens sometimes. Like, when it's, like, the edge, very edge of your hurtbox, on, like, the very edge of, like, the hitbox of the explosive flame, just, like, it doesn't quite, like, suck you in yet, and your model just basically falls out of it. Yeah, sent you at this really odd angle, honestly. Um, sometimes it just happens. That was some weird yeah, I think I think he probably would have died there, but there's still some weird guy there. So show canoeing a little bit just to mix up Luzu's timing. Sure. And once again, like applying all this down to the pressure, the stock taker has adapted really, really well, thinking that Weezy is gonna keep on doing it, so he's just gonna jump out. No no reason not to do that. This is really good. I feel like uh Weezy character that when he's at a deficit, he's really struggling to get it. Um so if Star Taker can just play this lead game and play it well, just kind of build a wall uh, around him. That will uh, really do miles here. Yeah, the Star Taker has dealt like so much damage to Florida alone. Weezu, but is able to slowly start to play this back. He just has to find one of those like up tilt and show you can make it for him to just something to be able to take the stock out. But I like what Zoom with the works here. I'm um, kind of keeping it tricky. Doesn't really want a uh, wizard to kind of get a good gist of where he is. Yep. Palutena has so much more mobility than Liu, and you just have to exploit that matchup. You don't want him anywhere near you. You don't want him touching you. And he's jumping out because he doesn't want to get hit by the Shoryu. And the back air armoring through that F tilt. Palutena can start to really be using that ability. Another back air. 
Gonna close it out. Mm -hmm. Really even game, but he like pushing that stuff. Like, no, no. To control of it. For sure. He capitalized like with Ryu suffers the most, For which sure. is getting off of the corner. You don't have a really high priority burst option. It and he just like kept him there for a really, really long time. Felt so much damage. And that's what Palatina does. She keeps you in the corner until she finds like a back air, or like a down tilt back air to close off the stock. Like very, very textbook, I think. Yeah, for sure. And sometimes, you know, sometimes the basics are where you gotta be. And it seems like Star Taker, you know, just kind of playing nice neutral, just kind of keeping it simple. And sometimes that works, you know, sometimes that's really just the key. Yeah, for sure. Um, but game two, I'm um, gonna be curious if Weezer is gonna be switching off to DDD because I do know that his DDD has taken games off of Stocks Palu in the past. Um, I am mistaken, he's gonna be sticking with the um, Wii. Yeah. And I also wanna know, I just looked up Brett because I was curious, the loser of this, gonna have to fight um, winner of Ominous Grace, Steel, or Sun. Okay. That's, yeah, that's that's scary. No matter who you're fighting, there. We, 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 we're not trying to drop into losers tonight. And right off the bat, Stop Ticker is able to get so much percent off of the conversion, trying to extend it with a falling fair, but Weezer brought it all the way back with those down tilts. Yeah, now these nair chains, you know, Palutain and bread and butter, just what you're used to. I'm not sure what Stock Ticker could be doing differently in response to Weezer's shield pressure. Does he have enough time to roll out, or will he get caught on, on the startup of it, is my question. Yeah, it's really hard to say. Especially in a matchup like this, I feel like um, Palutena really wants to keep you away, but Ryu really wants like, those scrambles, you know, where he gets in and just kind of puts him over. So, I don't know, you know, it's, it could be useful to know, but I don't think Stock Ticker wants to get close enough to find out. Yeah, sure. Oh, and he was trying to go for like the shield wave setup. Uh, that I, I believe Ryu and Ken both have that. Yeah, no, they got that forward tilt. I think, uh, I don't know if Ken has it. Ryu obviously has it. But it could be a show though. But yeah, no, Weezer are known to like throw out a couple of tilts and down tilts and then immediately throw it. So, uh, yeah. that's, that's something that he does quite a bit. So, good good awareness by Stock Ticker. He didn't want to get hit by it. A nice stall for Weezer because normally, like as a Ryu, you want to instantly go for like the Tatsu. That is a side B. Uh, the Tatsu. Um, yeah, Sa Tatsu is indeed side B, yeah. And he wanted to like dodge the explosive flame. And we saw side B right there, man. That was that was that uh that explosive flame. For sure. He was maybe trying to get like a drop shield lead or a jump lead, but otherwise he misspaced that back. It was a little bit too high up as a result. Now he is in the corner, wrong hit of yeah, that the was, Tatsu. Like, the back hit. Yeah. Push it. Both of these characters have really, really good low percent and mid percent combos for the most part. Stop ticker already able to. Okay, more uppers. I'm gonna say it straight up. Alton's upper is ridiculously good. It covers so much space. It sees up for so long. Yeah. It's relatively fast. Like I think frame ten it is. And, um, also, Ryu sucks at landing. He doesn't that, have that too, anything yeah. that can contest with that app. He has to hold it. And because you know how multi hits like work with the focus, like go he right has through to. it. Yeah. Yep. He can't rely on that in this matchup, which is honestly good. It would be really difficult. Yeah. Right now, Ryu able to connect the grab. He has all the stage control. He's looking for it, though he did not connect the up tilt into the up B. Okay, going for these fairs. I like what he did uh, there, you know, in the corner. Uh, you know, I don't think Weezer's ever done that. Just right, jump right off the stage in the uh, corner. Hmm. Oh, or jump yeah. right off the ledge. Yeah. Doesn't matter right now. Stop taking a A little bit of a lead. Let's see how far he can take it. Yeah, 124%. He's like looking for any commitments. He's looking for a down tilt. He's looking for up tilt. Or he's just looking for a straight up back end. Yeah, you know. Palutena, we all, oh, yeah. He definitely meant to do that in the other game. But uh, Palutena obviously knows what he's after that. Known to get hit by, short, the, by the side beat, the Tatsumaki, I guess. That move is ridiculous. It's that so good now. Yeah, it's 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 crazy. Ryu just like says, yeah, I don't care about the fact that you have a swinging this right in front of you. I'm going to run in and kill you for pressing this button right now. And honestly, I feel like, I do feel like he kind of needs it. Ryu's really good. Like, slowly and slowly got bubbled. 
under people's noses, and then eventually everyone's like, wait a second, he's really good. For sure, almost connecting down here, if Softiku was just a moment later, um, you know, we could have gotten him in between the, like, before he actually got the teleport out. I'm actually surprised Wizu didn't get that off there. I feel like he's kind of, you know, just been, uh, like, hitting the shield, you know. Oh, there's a forward tilt, yeah. Stock Ticker was holding shield uh, for quite a bit of time on this down tilt, so maybe Wizu will keep that in mind. Could really help him in this kind of situation. Yeah. Nice uh, tech chase there, but the up smash, of course, not able to take the stock quite yet. Oh my god, that just catches him. It's so big. Now, uh, Wizu was anticipating that he might be able to air dodge through it. Kill? No, no. Goodness. He's a big boy. Great air dodge right through the explosive plane. That's actually really hard to do. Yeah, his DI is back easily making 143 up. What a mix up again. Yeah. Wait, wait, what? what? Wait, are you wait, what? I I really what just thought. What just wait, happened? That was a back air though, right? Ooh, was that a fail? Wait, wait, what just happened? I thought it was a back air. Huh. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little, I'm a little confused at that. Oh no, no, finish the set, finish the game, finish the set. Yeah, I don't know what happened though. I would have assumed Palutena's back here would have been able to really do it, but Weezer didn't die, and now it's game three. That was just really weird. I mean, I have to assume we used four there, right? Like, okay, I'm so happy he's going villager. I love villager. It's one of my favorite characters. I'm so happy. I love seeing Stock Ticker's villager. I'm a little bit biased. Woo, yeah, woo, -hoo, yeah, woo. And, and, and this is when you know that Stock Ticker, he's not trying to approach. He is trying to be annoying with these forward airs, these back airs. Stock Ticker known to be an amazing, amazing villager player in Smash 4. But people don't know, he's still an amazing, amazing villager player in this game. So. Yes. Yeah. Some of the best on like the East Coast, period. Some of the best in the world, I'm just straight out saying it. It's one of the best in the world. And that's a setup in a tree at the ledge that is so scary because now he has one chip into it. He can get the hitbox extension, but then he could also chop it out at any given moment and also connect like a down throw down B if he's catching Weezu, you know, not the eye correct. Just having the pressure of the tree in the corner there is so, so menacing. Yeah, no, this pick seems to really be working out for sure, but right when I say that, Weezer. I mean, two hits to the percent where you can really tackle on the hurt. Zerial's doing a lot of percent. But I really do think this is a good big list tactic. You know, we have a character that he's like, hey, you know, I don't even want to approach you. I don't want to mess with you. I'm just going to roast up right now. Well, this is a super, super difficult matchup for you. Villager is just able to play that away for the, like, essentially the entirety of the set. Yeah, I could totally see that. And right now, Stock is kind of showing why. You know, just kind of pinning Weezer down at the ledge and using these long, long range moves, keeping it safe, keeping it simple. Oh, okay, he's winning. I thought that was going to be the stop for this. I'm not going to lie, I thought he would like fuck for an option and die. I feel like that happens in Ultimate way too much, but good on Weezer to not press another button. I know I would have. So. Well, I'm Oh, I'm, I'm a masher now. <laughs> I'm a masher and I'm proud. For sure. Uh, uh, These two, though, they're, they're, they're actually nice. not matching. They're playing pretty methodically here. Yeah, for sure. Um, mm, missing the connect on the up there. though. Um, I see Stock actually trying to cross up Weezer multiple times whenever he goes through Tatsu, but he always underestimates just the actual size of the uh, hitbox that just he gets like that, hit. yeah. A lot. You know, it, it's kind of crazy because it goes through projectiles. It seems like Stock Taker's, um, I think he has the right idea in terms of how to deal with it, but he's just not doing the, like, the proper amount of space. Yeah. yeah. He's a little bit too close to Weezer. I would just like to see him, see him take half a step back. That back is going to give him so much stage control. But nice drift from Weezer to go in toilets in the stage um, so yeah. that he'd be able to avoid the bone. Weezer's really moving off stage with Weezer. Are you a character that, um, you know, kind of struggles to move around sometimes, but Weezer's making him look really fast. Oh, oh, right under it. That, that's, that, that's what I'm saying, man. Oh Weezer, my the god. Remake of Smash 4. Uh, yeah, he's still got it in this game. All of these interrupts. Yeah, you just have to respect that because of the yeah, extended sure. shield stun of the uh, Lloyd on your shield. Villager's just gonna have to pull out that up smash. You have to just let him do it and try to get that neutral. I know you, you feel like, oh damn, he's pressing a smash attack. I wanna punish that right now. Yeah. Wait, just wait. Sometimes that's the bait in itself. You know, it's like, oh, look at me, I'm doing something silly. And then it's really not, you know, you can actually act out of it. That's like Game & Watch and both specialty, you know? Those characters have amazingly fast smash attacks. But uh, right now, it looks like Dark Tanker really kind of not realizing. 
Weezy was trying to think, or was trying to get a lead that stock took, he was gonna mash an air dodge, a neutral air out of disadvantage, but he just jumped out, so he's just gonna whiff that F smash. Oh, nice and safe. Oh, another side beat. So, you know, Sartakers, like we said, oh, oh. I like how Weezer's weaving behind these uh, bowling balls. It's actually not that easy. Um, Weezer's making it look easy, though. He's doing a really good job. He's not, he's not taking, he's not taking it. He's punished Stock Taker every single time that he's gone through bowling ball. But if you consider the risk versus reward, it's like, okay, Stock Taker is going to eat, like, what, 10 something percent, and Weezer's going to lose his stock for this. So, in that sense, it seems extremely skewed. Yeah, for sure. It's like right now, Really bad situation for Weezer. I'm just gonna come out and say it. Stock deficit. Stock taker content to not approach and just throw stuff at him. I'm not gonna lie, this is looking really hard for Weezer. Stock taker's just had a really consistent control. Yeah, that's a nice new space back here. Able to take out Weezer's last stock in a very, very confident two stock lead. Well, uh, stock taker. Good so, yeah, counting pick. That was a good set though. You know, I like to see the play from both of them. They both played really well. Mm -hmm. For sure. I think I actually have to play next.